made the deck kind of fat. And I, as I was doing, I was I was recognizing it too. And fat in a bad way. Not the PH fat, but the FAT fat with like, you know, maybe a little bit of... You know. I was going to make like an analogy, like health issues, but that seems a little too... I think I should just stop there. Isn't it funny how my dog sleeps with his head on the pillow like he's a damn human? Man, I swear, my dog, he watches me sleep and he's like, I'm gonna do that too. And lo and behold, he looks like me when he sleeps now. You know what's the craziest thing is that when you dog, so my dogs beg to go under the covers with me, which is very cute. They, they beg to be tucked in. They like to be tucked in every night with me. But uh, the craziest thing is that like, you're sleeping, and there was one time I was walking, and I I woke up, sorry, and I saw my Albi, my little black boss interior. He was on his back with his paws like this, you know, sleeping, but the but the covers were like covering up to his like chest, and I was like in the same position, like on my back, like kind of like resting like that. He was beside me doing the same exact thing. I was like, what is this dog doing? Cutest thing in the world. Cutest thing in the world, man. Make it a win? Oh, got it, bro. Let's make it a win. Make it a damn win. stick to what I feel is like good value all right and I'm not gonna try oh let's try this no you're not gonna hear the words let's try this I'm gonna be like I'm taking this this is what I feel is right um there's not gonna be any experimentation and we're gonna we're gonna knock it out of the park all right no more oh phantasmal could be interesting no 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 we've been there before it struggled in Ascension 15, it's gonna struggle in Ascension 17. We'll leave the names aside for this one. Memes and dreams. I also really like this thing of Courage deck, but the champ just destroyed me, you know what I mean? Like, that thing of Courage deck was sexy. It really was. But the champ said, no thank you. Now, the question is, do I... I think we do this, honestly. What's up, Biz... Biz... Bizu? Bizu, Bizu, B... I used to listen to a friend... I used to listen to these French, uh, chant... How do you say? Chantels? Um... These romantic songs. Romantic chant... Chantus? Chantus? Like... Anyways, I had a playlist because I was learning French and I was listening to like these French like Ne quitte pas Ne quitte pas And there's also another song where it was like uh, I forgot her name, she's a very famous French woman singer Anyways, that Bizu, I think those are those songs like Bizu, Bizu Something, It was a very cute little song that I remember The poison step. I'll skip. Bizu, bizu, bizu. Ne ne quitte pas. Ne ne quitte pas. Ne ne quitte pas. Ne ne quitte pas. That song is like it's very understated. About like he does a very good job of nailing that emotion. My acting's really bad. I know. I try to find. I need to know. I need to know this lady's name. She's a very famous French singer, man. Uh, French sing, uh, singer. 
What's her name? Edith. Edith Piaf. Ah, Edith Piaf. Of course. Edith Piaf. No, Edith Piaf was, was... No, I know she didn't sing this song. Edith Piaf was a girl, a lady that I, was, I remember singing. She used to have a really good song. I know that's Jack was... Uh, Jack, Jack Keats or Jack... But there was a lady that I used to listen to. And, um, I forgot her name. Let me see what the song was, actually, in particular. I know I'm getting distracted here. Edith Piaf had a one song in particular that I really, really enjoyed. Uh, no... Je ne regrette rien. That one? That, that's a really good song, but there's another one. La Vie en Rose, of course. La Vie en Rose and, uh, yes, Non, Je ne... Je ne regrette rien. Je... Je ne regrette rien. I used to listen to those songs. Anyways, guys, no more of this, uh, French escapade that I'm going on. Ba 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 ba. I think the flag might be better than Cloak and Dagger here. Ah, we already have. Let's do Cloak and Dagger once. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Why? Miniki de pa. No Miniki de pa shuriken. Oh my god, that's that's a pain, boys. That's a pain. That is a pain. Oh yeah, voulez-vous coucher avec moi, the <laughs> Moulin Rouge? I've been to the Moulin Rouge. Well, I went to the, um, I, I believe what, what it was supposed to be filmed around. I went to a cabaret in, in Paris. Should we try the mayhem? Nah, we're not gonna try anything, guys. We're gonna do what I feel like is gonna be correct. I could buy Oricalcum. Because it could be pretty good against, like, the knob or something, it allows me to be more aggressive. Is Oricalcum worth 100? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think so, my friend. Ooh, hello. So with that, we're upgrading new slides, of course. Nice. It's like no, it's, it's no, no way to get to bring on. Yeah, that's a really good song. Really, really good song. Let's do this. Open dagger. Good, the next. How you doing, buddy? We just spanked like a woolen. Oh, we spanked him. Oh, my goodness gracious. They're really giving me the stuff. How do you feel about Doppelganger with ice cream? With ice cream, it's not too bad, right? Because when you upgrade it, and ice cream involved, I feel like good things happen. Although outmaneuver of ice cream is also something I really, really enjoy. Outmaneuver and ice cream. Now we just did the Laga. Now we could go against Gremlin, but the problem with that is that I use a potion, both potions against Laga. Fear Pot and the Poison Pot. Now if we're going against Gremlin, we do have like Predator and the Weaken to kind of neutralize him a little bit. For the most part, we don't have that much for Laga. I mean, for Gremlin. Triple Sentry, I think we can handle as well, but again, at the same time... Uh, let's go for it. I want to play skills or not? I don't think so. I'll do this. Oh, maybe Cloak and Dagger is better because at least that's a skill that does damage, right? So 
So we're gonna get a lethal next turn, so we can block in full today. Well, there's not actually not guaranteed lethal, so we could we could do block because we are gonna get lethal next turn though. We are gonna lethal next turn. I mean, the bone is so good. Infinite blades, riddle of holes, dagger throw. I like infinite blades, but not so much against the guardians. I'm probably gonna skip here. I can't say I have awkward Dan. Although I, I've had, I have found myself looking up memes. I mean, meme culture has evolved like crazy, man. And people, a lot of memes I'm not filled in on, so I've, I've had to look up a meme or, a meme or two. Like, there was just one meme in particular that I, I kept seeing and I wasn't under... I'm trying to remember what, what it was called. Oh, it was the bee. You know how, like, the people put, like, a big red bee in front of stuff? I, I, I had to look that up. I was like, what is what is this about? Dagger Street Bane or Backflip? Hmm. I like Dagger Spray. What's up, Aaron? I'm doing good, buddy. I'm just trying to win the silent because we're having a lot of trouble with the silent. I'm kind of grinding my gears a little bit. Wow, all this card drawing, I didn't find the neutralize, huh? I guess I should have been back for the first turn. We have an exact. Exact amount of damage, that's crazy. That's nutty. That's some nutty stuff. Oh, Arrow, congratulations, bro. And how does your, um, StarCraft go? I know you were trying to practice StarCraft as well. Man, here's the number one. The number one thing you gotta do is just let this. Nick, don't, do not even think about your MMR. In fact, don't even look at it. Don't even look at MMR, man. Just play the next game and act like it's unranked. Because ladder anxiety, that it's it's really uh, counterproductive. Extremely counterproductive because I mean I understand it. It's easier said than done. It's not so much right build in particular though, you know, I know builds are important, but it's also just about understanding macro and like builds help you understand and ingrain certain macro tendencies or whatever. But uh, beyond getting like a, a, a correct build, you just gotta develop good macro habits. And once you do that, like, I mean, I do recommend picking up a build. And like going, going, taking that belt against against AI, and like really getting the timings down and stuff like that. So you just get a feel for like the timings of things, when to drone, when not to drone, etc., etc. But beyond that, and then that, that helps you understand like injection, creep spread, unit production, etc., etc. But um, that that's a tool to help you get better at your fundamentals, not so much a replacement for everything else. Now I was just talking about because he, he wanted some Zerg replays. I'm, I'm currently Diamond 2 Zerg, but uh, I haven't really been playing that much ladder recently. We've been playing Fortnite and stuff. We got a... Uh... I don't 
enough, man. It's not enough. Fight slow, but it's working. Oh yeah, Aero, you gotta go to a custom match and create a custom match and go against elite, uh, go against elite AI. But uh, don't worry about how easy or hard it is. Your goal should be getting your macro and timings down. Because that's just, that's just there so you're not just doing it against nothing. Yeah, get your macro and timings down you're good. Alright, beautiful. After image, grand finale or burst. Feeling, I'm feeling a little after image in my life. I'm feeling like a but burst doppelganger with ice cream could be nutty, as well as burst out maneuver with ice cream could be nutty. Now burst has a lot of potential with doppelganger, out maneuver, and just general things because we're gonna have energy to spend malaise, like at burst malaise if we get a malaise. After image gives me more consistent block, which is very nice, but we have. Paper Crane to weaken, which is going to give me a lot of damage mitigation, so I can probably afford to get Burst and try to do Burst up getting your shenanigans. But how useful would that be? I'm not sure. I think after Mitch might just be better overall. Yep, I did. That's what I. That's what I did. So what I did is I. Um. You go to spawning tool and look up a basic ZV, ZVP Roach Hydra push timing attack. And that helps you just get like a basic understanding. Any favorite uh, Clash for Ironclad? I think Ironclad is, if Clash could be good on lower on lower ascension, but once you get Ascender's Bane, Clash becomes pretty bad because Ascender's Bane is a curse and you can't play Clash with it. So I think it's what Ascension ten when the when the curse comes. Where is it? Yeah, Ascension ten is when the curse comes. So that's when Clash becomes bad. I was gonna do burst and I picked after image, my bad. Uh, we got runic pyramid with ice cream is potentially pretty good because we can go ahead and like hold on to something that can get a lot of value, like a skewer. Get potions, we can get wrist blade. Wrist blade gives us damage, right? So since we have after image and then let's say we potentially get wrist blade, we're gonna have potentially a ship deck where we're gonna have cloak and dagger, after image, blade dance, and stuff like that. It's, it's worth going Ravagers a lot. So Ravagers have really useful because they can do this thing called Corrosive Bio, which is really good at sieging buildings and destroying buildings. Um, you can zone out enemy units and do a lot of damage. You can use Ravagers to help take out tanks. You can use Ravagers to take out spine crawlers, you know, walls for, for, for Terran. Like, you can use Ravagers to uh, even attack flying units, whereas normally Roaches can attack flying units, but Ravagers can. The Bio can hit flying units. Um, it's just nice to have a couple of, so it depends on what you're using them for, but typically you do Ravagers, like, and you're trying to break in a Terran, and you want to, like, break the wall, get some Siege Tanks, maybe you can do it against, uh, Liberators, because Liberators are flying, and you can Ravagers those. It's good against other Roach battles, because you, you can get a little bit extra DPS by having them move out of the bio, because if they don't move out of the bio, it's a lot of damage. So they're useful, but I wouldn't rush right into them, but you will want to be getting a few of them, yeah. But that, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Worry about the other stuff. Worry about the other fundamentals. Um, let me let me see. Runic Pyramid, White Beast. I think Runic Pyramid could be interesting. I'm gonna go for it. I'm down. Now I kind of wish I had burst though. Anyways, let's see. 
I have a feeling we're gonna skewer's gonna be our win condition, guys. So I'm gonna craft a skewer win condition deck. Let's see what happens. Yep, you got it, man. Roach is the new slave. Yep, nailed it. I should be saving my energy, but for what though? Image to no more hair. And um, people, some people are on the fence about my hair, man. They're like, some people like, some people don't. But we can all agree that I, oh, I have Wally playing, so the Rune Pyramid was a little bit worse. I just realized. You just realized that, Jeremy? Yeah, I just realized that. Alright, it took me a second to realize that Rune Pyramid. Hmm. Yeah, maybe Bristol was better. Mistakes were made. Maybe he might be such was better. Honestly, how are we even killing this guy? This guy's a pain in the butt. We don't have what it takes against this, this man. I got a haircut, Mr. Roy. Wait, something happened to my hair? Something happened to my hair? Why didn't no one, why didn't no one tell me earlier? No, I, I just got a aggressive... I had a really aggressive shower. And... I came out like this. I need to get a weekend on this, this guy. So far, Rooney Pyramid looks like a whole bunch of ass right now. Uh, as expected, though. I think. Mm, no. I don't know. No trout. No. Wow, man. This is dull. This is some dull stuff right here. Backflip comes a little bit worse, too. What'd you miss? You missed some, some decent relics. Yeah, I picked up some decent relics. I really did pick up some decent relics. Prepare just to kind of like get some things out of my damn hand. Yeah, I like it. After image as well. Uh, the problem is we have ice cream, but okay, what's going on right now? is we um we need outmaneuver I, I should I should take an outmaneuver I need something damn that's if he was bad man Yeah, I'm the same way, Mr. Roy. It's crazy. I mean, it's not for me. It's not when I see it. It's just, it's a little more personal what happens to me, but you know, it, it, it's still the same thing happens. Let's kill this guy. Oh yeah. Oh my wa mo shingeru. I never actually said that. I know that's like a thing that everybody says and I've never said that. And now I said it. 
Oh, this guy's staying alive, isn't he? These birds are like the Bee Gees right now. In fact, every enemy I'm fighting right now feels like the Bee Gees. Ah, 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 staying alive. What's my opinion on the odds? Oh, I, I agree that Hunt, 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 who had it correctly, where, where it was, um, I believe it was around 40% on the odds. Flechettes with, you know, flechettes with Rony Pyramid could be pretty damn good. I, uh... We'll see what happens. We'll see what comes of it. I do have good relics. I just don't have everything else that's good. Panache. Outmaneuver, I think, is pretty damn sexy, guys. The Strange Spoon. How do we feel about Strange Spoon? Not too hot, right? So forty percent was correct, right? Yeah. Yeah, he he did the uh, he did the math. It, it made a lot of sense. I knew that's what is. I I knew the concept. I just didn't understand how to do it in equation form. Uh, I'll maneuver. Go off meta. Yeah, but I'm trying to actually win, and the problem is I've been going off meta and not winning. I think finesse could be cool with after image. And maybe I can get finesse panache. My P's do sound funny. Pan pan panache. Pan panache. And that could be a good way to get like some more damage. But uh, against the champ, we're looking for a skewer one shot. Aren't we? I do think I'm going to be good regardless. Alright. I don't know. I do think we should probably remove a strike. I'm not sure if you want panache, if we're gonna be able to play it that much. I mean, with after image, it could be potentially pretty good if we get the right cards, like cloak and dagger, blade dance, the more deflex. It's awkward though. Is there another shop I can see my money for? I'm not too hot about these. Snake skull. I'm gonna remove a strike. Do I buy Mall Bank? Nah, it's kind of expensive to buy that. Let's upgrade this and then upgrade the Albanuber. We're seeing a skewer, guys. Skewer will make this deck much easier. Or Terror. Both, preferably. Oh my god, we're gonna lose this fight, guys. Oh no! No, not like this, brother. No, 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 not like this. This is GG. I don't have discard for this. It's GG. Okay, that is some discard. There we go, that's something. Oh god, this is gonna be tragic. Okay, that's something, that's something. Okay, we do have discard. We have prepared. Prepared comes in handy. Who would have thunk it? Okay, it's actually going pretty well. Never mind. Uh, Alright, never mind. I should have saved that money, that energy for the ice cream, to be honest. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I'll take it back. You are pretty good. Sort of. I mean, you're still kind of troublesome, but... Oh, shit. Alright, never mind. I was scared for nothing. Dodge and roll, dagger throw, all out attack. Hmm, skip, skip. Probably upgrade flechettes though. Ooh, I guess we don't need to upgrade flechettes for now. But that that just happened. Uh, let's try to find like a beacon or something. Okay, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Okay, that's a lot of damage on my end, too, though. The boots. 
giving me some good damage. I, I like it. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Doing some good stuff for me, man. Yes, 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 yes. The boot is something. You do it, boot. You go. You get him. You tell him. You tell him what's up. You tell him how you feel. I should probably get rid of these defense so I'm not drawing. Okay, never mind. Shit. War paint. We're back at it again with the war paint. We got concentrate. Whoa! That's beautiful. Shit. Just give me ooh, add a card. Yes, yes, yes. Give me a damn skewer. So setup. No. Escape plan? Nah. I maneuver again. Then I feel like we're going to have way too much energy. And if we have that much energy, then what are we doing with it? In fact, because we're going to have so much energy. Because we're going to have so much energy. I feel like we should get more card draw. So that we can at least dump it out into something. Or take choke, which does feel kind of awkward, right? But if we take acrobatics, we can, we can use the energy. Oh, but I'm not getting that much energy that Acrobatex. I'm actually not getting that much energy. Another odd maneuver, Cloak and Dagger. Escape plan, Eviscerate, Finisher. Finisher can be good because you can always set it up to be the best that it can be. I can just take another odd maneuver. And I have two of them. Yeah, Riddle, Riddle is going to be uh, two for 25 damage for two. That's whatever. Um, Let me see. Okay, how am I going to beat the champ? Honestly, I think I need more like card draw. Because I, now I have Concentrate, I'm going to need more card draw. So it's either Acrobatics or Backflip. I think it's Acrobatics. I think so. I need a good potion, maybe with the artifact pot. pot. The finisher could have been good as well. Did, did my contacts arrive? Guys, let me go put my contacts on. My contacts finally arrived. Oh my god. Hallelujah. 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 My contacts finally arrived. Oh my god. Wow, I can let go of those glasses that have missing leg. Oh. I can actually look a little bit more decent. I feel like it's a brand new world. A whole new world. A new fantastic point of view. Did you know we can't see each other even when he leaves the room? What do you mean? Whoa, dude, Flechette's is doing some bonkers stuff, man. Flechette's, I'm proud of you. It's actually kind of surreal because I am not used to having my, I haven't had my contacts for a long time. It's almost too, it's like too good to be true right now. Now I could kill this guy right now, or hypocrite this boy. Let's just kill this dude. Wow, dude. 
I can read the chat so crisp and clear. My glasses are such a bad quality. I can actually see things. I'm gonna blame all my losses on the lack of uh, contacts. So, whoever was playing on my account, that that man with glasses wasn't me. I feel like I'm opening my eyes wide because it's just like, it's intense. Okay. Yo, we're killing it with the shits. Another, I'm gonna, another backflip. We need the car drop it because we gotta concentrate. Killing it. Does he know we can hear you when he leaves the room? Oh yeah, I know. I know that you can hear me. I know. That's why I sing loud. I was like, Hallelujah. Should I do artifact on this? Nah, because we're hoping for a good potion, right? Although, we got to be careful. But this fight could just take me out right here, right now. And I didn't do it. I went over. Probably a mistake. Probably a damn mistake. Mm. I don't know about this one. Oh god. Oh god. So we're gonna need this to be weakened, right? Paper crane. Alright, we got this. Easy. Easy. That's a lot of a lot of a lot of stuff. I want that energy. Why do I want the energy? Well, because we have card draw, so if worst comes to worst, we have Imagine doubling it with this energy, that's insane. That's almost too much. In fact, it is too much. Bom, 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 bom. But we need skewer on the other hand. What exactly are we accomplishing right now? Yes. Okay, flechettes. So this is just the flechette cycle deck. Just cycle into flechettes and forget about everything else. The energies. Dude, we need. Please give me. If they give me skewer, I would be such a happy boy. Please give me skewer. Yikes. Is that catalyst or burst? Ah. Uh, what are we bursting, though? First stop maneuver is such a strong combo. Oh, we talked about that. First stop maneuver is so strong. The problem with that is, again, what am I doing with this energy? First concentrate is pretty damn nutty as well. Only problem is I'm gonna have to get rid of flechettes. Should I just kill this guy first? Let's do this. All right, we're not gonna do burst concentrate just yet. Yo, Epidier with the Twitch Prime. Thank you, buddy. Welcome to the germ pool. Just gave the Twitch Prime away. Thank you for the support, man. Well, we're gonna have to go ahead and get. Oh, you already got the. New You're on top of it, brother. Thank you. Give me a potion too, man. We can also get a potion with this artifact. That could save us. Bum, 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 bum. The boot is actually so, so good, man. For the situation that I'm in. Burst out maneuver. Why do we want all that energy? Don't know. We have it, though. All right? It's ours. That's, that's what I like to do. You know, this deck, like, so if we still could do the same fundamental things, which is like, like, just using all that energy and draw into cards, except all the cards that I'm drawing into are going to be dazed. Naturally. But that's, that's okay, because we gave me in the bone. So if he hits us for five more HP, we get me in the bone, which I don't mind. And I'm kind of down to get flechettes at some point. Although I don't want to get too many days because days don't help with flechettes. That's nice. That's nice, that's nice, that's nice. GG. I should probably take five damage, right? I can't I can't only make attack, so that's fine. Skewer. So expertise is also pretty good. So we can we can talk about things like, okay. Um we could do 
get a lot of energy with uh, burst out maneuvers, right? Ton of ton of energy. And then when the going gets going, we play a lot of cards, do expertise, keep playing a lot of cards, we just rinse and repeat, right? So I think there's con the concept is sound. What else did I want to do though? Oh, thank you, everybody. I appreciate that so much, man. Yeah, I mean, if you have a free Twitch Prime sub sitting around, I mean, most people don't even check the top right of the screen to see if they have a Twitch Prime sub available. Most, some people have them available, and they don't realize it's just free money to give to creators. You bring up a really good point, after Deer, that, uh, first of all, I really appreciate the support. And the next thing is, it's Brumblebee with the Twitch Prime. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, for some reason, for some reason, the sub alerts are not coming off, so... Either I'm going to have to do it vocally, or Mooksy's going to have to kind of step it up. Oh, shit! Thank you. Oh, shit! Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the germ pool. Okay. What was I saying? We were going to upgrade something, right? What were we going to upgrade? Acrobatics to get a little bit more card draw, or maybe even expertise to make it even a little bit better. Yeah, let's do that. Now, again, we, should, we said we could have gotten a potion. They nerfed expertise, I forgot. Could have got a potion with the artifact. That didn't work out. So, all in all, we're kind of still in the same predicament. On maneuver. Now, should we wait for burst? I feel like we should, but at the same time, we have a long way to go with this fight. And this guy doesn't play any days or anything in your deck, so... We're smooth sailing. Now, how often do we want to do for the shets is the question. Burst, concentrate, that's that's the jam, boys. That's the jam. Well, this is the wrong turn to do it, actually. Because uh I mean this I mean this is this is how you get expertise to, to this is what a deck's gonna do, guys. I'm just showcasing it, alright? All the energy, expertise, yada yada yada. Bum 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 and we just, we're cycling our deck really, really, really fast, actually. It's, it's quite incredible. We're cycling like a madman. Matter of fact, I'm gonna do burst all bringing her just to get it out of there. We could have made it more spicy. Could have made that massively spicy, but it's all good. Concentrate again. Oh my god. It's too good. Concentrate's broken. Give me bursts. Burst out maneuver? Oh god. What more do I want? As long as I'm getting energy back every turn that I'm spending this much energy, then I can keep up the, uh, the flow. So he's gonna make me vulnerable, so I gotta be, I gotta play around that. But the thing is, I've been having trouble actually like playing around as vulnerable recently, because he just does this thing where he makes you vulnerable for days and days and days. It's very hard to control. So boom, like there, now he's making me vulnerable again. Like, what do I do about that? Okay, so four turns are vulnerable. Okay, so then I got on the second turn of my vulnerable, I gotta go push him. If I really want to, like, maximize my chance of success, I don't do anything until the fourth turn of my vulnerable. Now, if in between this turn and the next, like, boom, vulnerable again. Oh, what do you know? I actually can't. It's just impossible to avoid the vulnerable. It really is. I guess we could do artifacts. Maybe that's the way. <laughs> God damn. Okay, on the second turn of my vulnerable, I'll push him forward. I want to get this ship out of the way, but it's gonna do five damage. I can't play it until he has metallicize. Why doesn't he have metallicize, by the way? Champ, what are you doing? Again, you're making me vulnerable, bro. 
You know what? Fuck it. I'm pissed off. Just, we're going for it. You really, you really don't give a crap, do you? All right, guys, this is a big expertise. All right. Hold on to your harnesses. We also have a lot of energy next turn. And we have Predator again. In fact, I mean, if we can get into Concentrate enough times, a little bit of a semi-infinite. Okay, never mind. The fun stops here. Still pretty decent, though. Still pretty... Oh, my goodness gracious. Fischetz is a powerhouse. Oh, my. Yo, these are my favorite kind of decks. I absolutely love these decks, guys. These decks bring me such joy. And Boot is doing so much work. Oh, Boot done so much work, Boot, Boot, Boot. If we don't get lethal here, I don't know what to say, guys. I do not know what to say. There's no world in which we don't get lethal here, right? GG! Oh my god, you're trying to give me malaise? Do I even take it, or is that disrespectful? Am I disrespecting the game by taking malaise here? Man, the boot was so good, though. It's crazy. I think I'm disrespecting the game by taking this, but you know what? This is this is the way we do it, guys. This is how we take over since 17. It's been kicking our ass a lot. We can go for the sustain. I think I like the Astrolab a little bit. We're going to go for energy. It helps me get things going, right? The energy, the fourth energy helps immensely, but I feel like, to be honest, once we get rolling, we're good on energy, so I actually might just take the Astrolab and get rid of these strikes. Thousand cuts, finisher, and slice. Not bad. Not bad. Thousand cuts against Leon Deca. Shit, I'm seeing some good stuff happening right now. And we have a lot of gold too, so we can hit both these shops. Yo, that's that was pretty spectacular. That's pretty spectacular, actually. Solid. Oh man, this is gonna be. It's gonna be we're, in, we're in for a ride on this one, boys. We're in for a ride on this one. Oh, we oh shit. Yo. Zero copies with the Twitch Prime. Welcome to the germ pool, buddy. Appreciate the support. Now, do we want to malaise this guy straight up now? Because that guy's gonna be a pain in the butt? Or do we say, you know, I'm kind of curious to do expertise and see what happens? Now, if I let them hit me, they do get me in the bone. But let's just do Malays. Probably wasn't the best play. Whatever. I don't care. I don't really care. I gotta be careful, though, because I'm, I'm actually losing my energy advantage. Because these guys are... They're not as wimpy as a champ. They demand a lot more defense. Burst to flex. Should've done for Chets first, huh? It's okay. 14. 27. Alright. AFK Abby, what's up, big boy? I just called you big boy. Uh, I'm not sure why I called you big boy. Um, I'm sure you'll forgive me, right? Forgive me for that one. Ba, 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 ba. How much work can we do here, actually? It's like two damage. I guess that's fine.
Not sure it would have been good after all, huh? So infinite blaze is not bad, because just it adds a thousand cuts, it adds an after image. But it does also... It could also potentially clog my hand. I mean, I'm going to play the shiv regardless. So it's not going to really clog the hand. It clogs the first hand. My first turn. My first turn, I have three energy, and it's kind of problematic. But I think it could just help. And it's also... There's thousand cards just boot. It's after image as well. Thousand cards to boot after image. It has a lot of uses. I think it's fine. I think I'm getting a headache from wearing these contacts. I haven't had them so long. Only if they are armor. I know. I know it's true. Hmm. Thank God they changed these guys, huh? Thousand guys is good, but then I can't play Predator. I mean, uh, we'll get me in the bone. That's perfectly fine. I got me in the bone. I'm happy about it, to be honest. That's actually, to me, that's perfectly ideal. You get me in the bone. I'm happy about that me in the bone there. Extremely happy about it. Okay, not extremely happy, but I'm happy. What's up, JD? Week? Damn, buddy, you're putting in the work. I mean, you're making that money, so it's nice. I hope you're, hope you're feeling all right, though. I hope you're not like working yourself too much. You know what I mean? Flying is not bad, but yeah, it's unnecessary. You got a pot, good instincts, blade dance with after image, and thousand cuts is pretty damn good. And the boot as well. We got turn up. We got Mercury Hourglass. I like Mercury Hourglass. Kind of like removing a strike. Oh, we don't have a strike. Well, I think also we have Finisher, right? So Finisher as well with Blade Dance can be pretty good. Ah. I think Blade Dance works the deck pretty well. I What would I remove? There's also another shop, so I could also just... I'll take a Blade Dance and we're just going to save the rest of the money. Even though Mercury Eyeglass is really good. I'm curious to see... Yeah, I killed both of them. I killed both of them, but... I could poison one of them. To be honest, I could do this and poison this guy now and get it over with. Yeah, I don't know, man. Okay.
Cutter takes too much of my energy, to be honest. But it's useful. This fight, this fight is ridiculous. Holy shit. Flechette's plus. I feel like Flechette's plus is pretty good damage. Uh, I sh maybe I could have. I, I, I mean, I know that I could win. I just said I, I need to do it specifically. That was rough. That was a rough fight. Uh, th that having four energy really hurts. Alright, Flechette's plus versus Slicer Backstab. Chest press is pretty good, but it's all about getting set up, and I feel like is that gonna help me set up? Probably not. And once you're already set up, do we are we good? Do I need more front loaded and back step? Chest plus is pretty damn good though. Hmm. It's pretty damn good. I like it. I woke him up. We're not dead, dude. We're not dead. Relax, relax, relax. I know you're memeing, but we're not dead. Oh, that's a funny meme, though. I like it. <sighs> you are memeing. Don't tell me you're not memeing. How can you be memeing when I have this going on in my deck? This is my life right now. 
How can you meme this? But how can you be memeing this? No, but really? No, but really? How can you meme that? See, that is a really good one. I don't have to worry about a damn fucking lumpy woman with daggers that give you wounds and hit you for tons of damage in the face. We don't have to manage her. Yeah, her deck can do some stuff. I have a time to breathe. I mean, Dora Deca kind of doesn't let you breathe either, to be honest. So, I might have a lot of trouble against them, and they also do give me dazed. A lot of the same issues I just faced in that last fight, Dora and Deca do similar things. They don't, give, like, they don't let you breathe. They give you statuses. So, for, we probably are dead just based off that alone. Acrobatics. Piercing Whale. Piercing Whale can let me breathe a little bit. I think Acrobatics from more card draw. I'm liking it. Um, one thing we need to upgrade though is, I think Burst is a good upgrade. I think time is more difficult? I don't know about that. I don't know. Maybe. I think we have a big malaise that we can make time eater a joke. Is malaise time eater easy? Easy peasy. Survive the first couple turns, get some energy, malaise time eater. Alright, much more manageable. We have Paper Crane. Should be pretty easy. Though on deck, you can't do malaise and win the game. Yeah, so wake one, you do a big malaise, then you save up a lot of energy, go into the second phase with so much energy, you probably go infinite. Uh, but again, you have to also get, like, good card draw. This is a really disgusting looking pistachio. Um, upgrade the burst. Upgrade burst. I don't have corpus explosion, though. Your yeah, burst is not a bad upgrade. Nah. I mean, yes, it is, because we have after image, so this is now it's playing. Whatever, I'm playing burst twice. We just gotta survive this. Oh my god, and we didn't rest. Because I was like, okay, we're trying to get me the bone, but do I burst malaise? I feel like it's not good enough. Oh my lord. I'm very worried. Very, very worried. I need energy. Some good damage, but that's not enough. Fuck. Oh my goodness gracious, this boy's crazy. Man. If I just had a moment to like breathe properly, like by getting out maneuver first early on with burst out maneuver, yes, we can win. Uh, we gotta do melee just to get the weekend, to be honest. I kind of want to do like burst out maneuver as a play, I suppose, but I also kind of want to do the weekend's important. But I kind of want to do out maneuver and then melee. God. Damn, dude. Savage. We need to get a week in here. We need to get a week in no matter what happens. Thousand cuts, I should probably play it, but it's like, it's expensive, man. And we're, we're in desperate need of a weekend, so. That's also not bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we have to play a card. I could do burst backflip, but I need to remove stuff first. I gotta do burst backflip. Then I gotta do concentrate because we have bursts, right? So we do concentrate because of the bursts. And then uh, I can go for the kill with finisher, I suppose. But then what we're gonna need to do is. Acrobatics. Now we have burst again, so we can do bursts, um, you know, deflect, and then survivor, right? And then go for expertise and look for some even more energy or the weaken, which 
ultimately this came down to me wanting to get the weekend, so we're gonna look for the weekend, you know what I mean? Though we could do finisher, my goal is to get the weekend. Now if I get a blur, obviously I can do some work with that. Still didn't find the weekend. There's the weekend. Jesus. About damn time. At that point, I might as well just went for the kill. Let me get Fletcher to do more, right? Because if I do Fletcher now, it's only 12. But if I do, if we can get more out of it. We have double Fletcher next turn. That's going to be 30 plus 36. Get a Rex, kid. Play dance acrobatics. Uh, cloak and dagger, play dance acrobatics. Uh. I'm a really big fan of blade dance with like finisher, after image, all that stuff. Acrobatics for more card draws. So we could do what we just did now, which is basically draw till we keep finding concentrate and other stuff. Or just skip or cloak and dagger. It was easy, not even close. Not even close. You're talking? Not even close. No, I know I was kidding. I'm just kidding. It was it was definitely a, a rough one. <clears throat> I don't know if I need more card draw. Uh, and I think I do or what we don't need more card draw, and I think play dance is gonna be really sexy. I wanna rest, and we have a big shop coming up. It could either be a lizard tail, sorry, oh. a waffle. Pendip is very good. Pendip is very, very, very good. That's what I need. We got another concentrate. That's absolutely fantastic. We probably can go infinite now with this uh, concentrate. That's a footwork. The footwork helps a lot. I think with reflex is not bad. Reflex with concentrate and prepared and stuff like that. We can probably have some really long turns. Concentrate is very good. Very, very good. Uh, do we want the full work on top of that? Maybe even do Abacus. Every time we shuffle our deck, we get six block. Is this the first Abacus deck in existence? What if we do the bomb? What if we do the damn bomb? At the end of three minutes, do bomb, stack it up, keep doing bomb, bomb, burst, bomb, burst, bomb, again, again, again. And before you know, we're doing, at the end of three turns, 120 damage. Is that likely? Yo, Rob, thank you, man. Oh, thank you for the tier one sub. Welcome, dude. Welcome to the, uh... Welcome to the, the germful, buddy. Thank you. Ah. Why didn't you struck? What happened? Skipped acro? Because I have this. Look. I have backflip. Expertise, acrobatics, acrobatics, another backflip. We got two backflips, two acrobatics, and an expertise. That didn't seem sufficient for you? Skip cycle and draw, then gets energy gain for more cycle and a relic that benefits from the cycle. Uh, we're taking country for sure, yeah. Uh, I don't know if I want reflex. I think the Vajra is useful because it makes like the upgraded flechettes much better, right? And it makes finisher much better, especially with pen nib. All right. Now we could do the abacus because we're gonna be shuffling deck a lot. We can't buy the Abacus and the Bomb, so we can try out the Bomb the first time we have to get the Bomb to be played. Or, we just do Abacus because we wanted to survive take the footwork as well. If I were if I were to remove, I would probably remove... To be honest, I would remove Dagger Spray at this point. The thing is... Yeah, I got you, Blarg. I know somebody already back, uh, sent, said that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get on that. Now, the thing about advocacy huh. is that I'm, if I'm shuffling my deck, 
Like, I'm already getting a sufficient amount of block, in my opinion. If my deck is working right, I think I'm getting a sufficient amount of block. I think footwork is important. And now we can either remove, take the bomb, reflex, remove, abacus. No, reflex and abacus make sense because you're drawing and, you know, remove all the plans. You're right, yeah. Yo, thank you, Kitsmiki. Appreciate it. I'll speak it started by giving you extra block. I don't know. I think Abacus is, I think Abacus is cool. And it, it, I mean, if, we're, if we're thinking about YouTube, that's a cool YouTube title, right? Silent Abacus deck? Maybe. Yeah, well, the pants removes up for zero, which I don't think it's a good removal. I think removing Dagger Spray is better. And we have Athermir, so playing a card for zero is not that bad. Give me the damn bomb now, bro. I'm trying to win, man. The Dexterity Pie only lasts for one turn. If it was a, a real Dexterity Pie, I would buy it, yeah. You can also go YOLO and try to get a good power potion. The thing about concentrating card draws is that I want to be getting dazed. I wouldn't remove infinite blades now. I would remove dagger spray. Dagger spray is the worst. The infinite blades is a power that gets rid of itself for one, and gives me shivs, which we're going to be help me control pendip, help me get finisher going. All right, doing a little bit of damage with a thousand cuts. So infinite blades is not something you would remove, but dagger spray is something you consistently keep getting, and I think it's just awkward for one. All the plants is fine because I can just play it for zero. It's not that big of a deal. I'm gonna remove the dagger spray and I'm gonna buy a power pot. I think I, I, might, I think I might take the reflex. I think we're getting enough to discard the reflex could be okay. Um, problem with reflex though, I mean, it could be kind of a dead draw. The boot does what Vajra does most of the time. Yep. The Vajra will be only good for like the finisher, which could be nice, especially with Pendib and also with the upgraded flechettes. But other than that, the boot is doing Vajra's job. I think, uh, I don't know if I need wow. Reflex. What if we take the Fear Pot? Maybe that maybe that'll be very useful to have to go for the lethal on the Donu. I know I have a lot of discard. I don't have a lot of discard. But this only becomes good when you upgrade it, and I would have to upgrade it. I don't think I have a chance to upgrade it. Um, I think I like the potion, to be honest. I'm going to Now, if we end up getting an artifact pot, I'm going to feel pretty, pretty messed up about that. I got to pretty concentrate, I would say, because if I burst it, it's going to be feel much worse. But it's not, it's not a super big priority. <clears throat> I think footwork's a pretty good priority. I mean, to be honest, I feel like we need to do vulnerable now just to kill these guys. These guys are just, these guys are crazy. If we do acrobatics, we can find concentrate. We do have two concentrates, so I feel like acrobatics is a good. Hmm, we could do, never mind. Yeah, it wasn't worth, I mean, we could do the fire fear pot now and hope that we get That's 32 damage, what am I talking about, right? That's 32 damage. Ah, right, should we get me in the bone here? Could be worse. Burst Concentrate, if I do Burst Concentrate, if I do Burst Concentrate, I'm uh, discarding my whole hand. So I wanna do Burst Concentrate maybe last. What I wanna do though is maybe Burst Blade Dance. Well, no. Oh, then let me do Concentrate and then let me do Predator and then Burst Cloak and Dagger gives me 10 damage, right? And then if I do Predator, I'm short by uh, 5 damage. But if I do Concentrate afterwards, and then I just leave Blade Dance, and then I can kill that guy. So we got this.
Oh, wait, I did that wrong. One, two, three. Yeah, Contra is actually too spicy. It's actually too spicy. It's okay, though. This works. That works. Works just fine. Oh, let's face my pen nib. Whoops. That's some decent damage. Hmm. Especially if I get my pen nib, but let's do footwork. I'll maneuver. And I'm hoping that I can get rid of his artifacts so I can do them belays. Lay straight up now and then just try to get a weak. Uh, let's see what we draw. That's 16 damage. Good damage. Power pot times two. Shit, that could be really good. Do I want any of these? I don't think so. The flex is not bad, I would say. I need to upgrade the second concentrate though, because the second concentrate is pretty hard to use. Um, I got another power pot. I want that more than a pure pot. It could be good. It could also be trash. That's why you shouldn't buy potions, because I hate that you get, you get potions offered to you. Mm, I do think the flex is not bad though. Now we have enough card draw to su suffice it. A uh, rare relic. Yeah. This could be bad though. This could be lethal. Thousand cuts ray form. Hmm. Three rounds and thousand cuts. Or a ray form. Thousand cuts. Although it's not upgraded, of course. Maybe thousand cuts first was better. Oh, that's gonna be a pain in the butt, to be honest. <clears throat> we need concentrates and shit. Otherwise, we're just kind of screwed. Oh, we have days as well. Yeah, it's gonna be painful. Do we do thousand cuts of blade dance? We're not killing this dude, are we? That's twenty damage, right? But if I make him. Twenty damage if I do fish shots over here, and then blade dance finish him off. I just take that hit to the face. And hopefully we get the weaken and everything else and survive. Now instead of doing blade dance, we can do cloak and dagger. Nah, it's not good enough. Well, it's doing 1-1, one, one, right? So it's 1... I guess if I did... Vor no. Probably made a mistake here. By doing that, it's also going to ruin my pendant. If I did Blade Dance first, I could have had pendant actually. Play dance, play dance, and then pin up this guy. That guy would survive. I mean, I'll get low. I mean, the question is, do I want to do cloak and dagger? Kill this guy, and then take the extra hit. The hit's gonna be so the cloak and dagger is gonna mitigate this guy's damage anyways, right? So why not just cloak and da dagger? Yeah, but I, I, I think so. If I do cloak and dagger, it's gonna mitigate this guy's damage, anyways, right? So by killing this guy, 
and I do Cloak and Dagger, it's the same as if I did Blade Dance. But, well, Blade, actually, not necessarily, not necessarily, not necessarily. Not necessarily. Now, I could depend him now for 8, which is pretty shitty, or I could save it. Honestly, I'm gonna save it. We have Fear Pot as well. So if you do Fear Pot, that's gonna be, what, 60 damage? That's a start. Alright. Is it worth it? Probably not. I wasn't sure if it was worth it or not. Finisher kills him. I mean, anything anything would have killed him. Maybe I didn't have to go if you're probably, because I probably needed that for the boss. Piercing was really good. Buys me some time. The deck's getting so fat, though. It's getting so fat. All that for specimen, bro. Why is specimen still a rare relic? You gotta be trolling me. Why is specimen still a rare relic? This used to be a boss relic. <laughs> I mean, I guess it is a good rare relic, to be honest. It is pretty good. It's very niche. And it being niche pisses me off. I don't need niche, I need good. Look for finisher. Look for finisher, boys. Never mind. That would have been a sick finisher too. There's finisher. Yeah, damn doozy. I'm gonna look for finisher here, boys. I mean, like, a good one, I mean, I, mean, I, I have finisher, I mean, like, I'm gonna try to use finisher. Great success. This is, what I want my, this is what I want my deck to do in theory, with Pendib, like, things like that, you know? Like that's, that's the ideal situation. Uh, especially with Fear Pot that I just gave away, which I probably panicked, and I'm regretting it right now as we speak. Regretting it. Calculated gamble. That could help me just in case I have a bad draw. Alright. Do we rest? I feel like we do. What would be a good upgrade though? Concentrate? I think at this point we rest. Although we could have actually managed with not resting. I think concentrate is a pretty good upgrade. Okay, we got thousand cuts right away. You can concentrate right away. It's important to get these powers out of the way to be honest. Infinite Blades you gotta get out of the way as well, but so it's either tree It's either I play Infinite Blades or I get Welly Psych planes out of the cycle and keep some energy. First off maneuver is so good. I might cream. Cream what, Jeremy? I'm not gonna finish the sentence. Come on, bro. Not like this. Alright. First couple turns are the awkward turns. We will stabilize. Alright? We will stabilize. Don't worry. We, we will stabilize. We go for, for set pen nib. Is that good enough? Could we do better? I feel like we could do better. But I'll go for it. It's better than nothing. To be honest, I gotta do piercing wheel and I gotta end up doing my laser on the guy in the front. That's, that's my best bet. That's my best bet to stay alive. That's my best bet. I, I, I lose all my energy advantage, right? But it buys me time for the front. 
and I can I can be more I can get energy back on these turns because I'm doing things like because I did that I'm, I can get more energy back by not having to fully block basically. Now I need to get the guy in the back weakens. Don't do rather. Uh, we do have finisher here, so we have blade dance, blade dance finisher, and I don't know how much damage that's going to be. Let's do the math. So if we do burst, that's six shivs, right? Plus another four shivs, that's ten attacks. Plus the one I already played, that's eleven attacks. Uh, so it's going to be eleven times eight, so it's eighty-eight damage. Now each shiv is going to be doing five damage, so that's going to be, like I said, ten. 4, 10 shivs times 5 is 50. 88 plus 50 is lethal. So we need to make room. We need to make room for this. Unfortunately, we don't have room. So what we need to do first, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Alright, so if I do burst, I have 8. If I do blade dance, I have 7, which means I could do um, 3 shivs. Now the problem with that is... How could we do if we just do instead of so instead of doing the second blade dance? How about what if we do four less attacks? So let's say we do six shifts, which is going to be thirty damage plus seven times eight is fifty-six. Not quite good enough either. Fuck me. Got pen nib. We do have pen nib. So since we have pen nib, we can probably play this around differently. So if I do six shifts, it's going to be not enough. Because I'm thinking I'd do Burst Survivor twice, make room for the Blade Dance. So if, if we just fully defend, so let's, wait, so if we just fully defend actually, because next turn we have, next turn we don't have to defend as much because the deck is kind of fucked. So what if I do Burst, Defend, Survivor twice, and make room, play it on another Defend, and then next turn we do the, the combo. We're still drawing five cards next turn, though. We have concentrate. That helps. But now I don't have burst. Eh, so here's what we're gonna do. I just I just realized I don't have burst. Here's what we could do though. We can still just do finisher and we don't have to make it bursty. It doesn't have to be bursty, it's fine. It doesn't gotta be bursty. This is just fine for me. I'm happy with this. It doesn't gotta be crazy bursts, right? I, I think I did the right play. And then we could go at always do flechettes. Now this guy's gonna have seven strength. That's manageable. Flechettes is lethal. Got pendant for another flechettes. Weaken again, fantastic. It's gonna do concentrate, but then I have to get, just keep the days. I guess it's fine. I don't care. Finish sure it was gonna be pendants. G F M G. Hi yeah yeah. Bro, that's the most math I had to do on the side in a long time. We got one more in me. Let me go use the bathroom guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Drop a follow if you guys are new here.